Hello everybody and welcome back to Golden Dragon Games. I'm your host Rocky2815 and welcome to my playthrough of Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Episode 2. Let's begin. And I'm just going to quickly turn down the volume of my headphones. Okay, let's start. Now, if you remember in the first episode, we got the Shiny Beldum, but also I was not using my fancy new Capture Card. So, this is a pretty big test run for me. But anyway, let's go on with the game. You going to say, Rocky, go set the clock in your room, honey. I hung it on the wall right between your desk and that big map. Hmm, okay, I guess it's time to set the clock. The clock on the wall isn't moving, you've got to set the time. <coughs> now what time is it? Oh, no, it's, it's doing it automatically. The hour hand was set to 17 and the minute hand was set to 2. Yeah, that's the right time. How do you like your new room, Rocky? Good, everything's put away neatly. Then, they finished moving everything in downstairs too. It's really, yeah, it's so nice to have Pokemon around to help us. Oh, but you should make sure that everything's all here on your desk. Okay. Um, there's some sort of journal. We've got the bed as usual. We even got a Wii U. <laughs> What's this? A Snorlax doll. Oh, Rocky, Rocky. Quickly, come quickly. Huh? What's this? It's the Petalburg Gym. Maybe Dad will be on TV. Interview. <coughs> we bring you this report live from in front of the Petalburg Gym. Next up, a special look at a long awaiting meteor shower in the next Star Show. Oh, is it already ended? Looks like your dad was on, but we missed his part. What a shame. But that reminds me, one of dad's friends lives in this town. Professor Birch is his name. He lives right next door, so you should go over and introduce yourself. Okay, let's go and have a look. Music is so great. I love it. Oh, on your right house. Oh, hello, and you are? Oh, Rocky, our new next door neighbor, welcome. We have a daughter about the same age as you. She has been so excited about making a new friend. She should be in her room upstairs. I will. I hope you will go and introduce yourself. Okay. Ah, uh, yes. Me. I believe this character is called May, if I remember correctly. And I love the 3D cutscenes. <clears throat> Pokemon fully restored, items all ready. What's she talking about? She doesn't even have any Pokemon yet. And. Huh? Who are you? Oh, you must be Rocky. You, your move was today, huh? Well, I'm May. Glad to meet you. Got the name right. I actually have this dream of becoming friends with uh, Pokemon all over the world. And then when Dad, oh, I mean Professor Birch, told me about you moving here, Rocky. Well, I was hoping you would be nice and we could become friends. But, but uh, that's just silly, isn't it? Uh, I've just met you, right, Rocky? So, what am I talking about? <laughs> oh no, I forgot! I was supposed to be going out to help Dad catch some wild Pokemon. Rocky, I'll see you later. 
Yeah, okay. Let's have a little look around her room. So she does have a Pokemon doll, but she does have the uh, Wii U, but the white version because I believe the white version of Wii U was 16 gig, and then the black one is 32. But let us go out there. I think I heard someone screaming up ahead. What should I do? What should we do? Somebody has to go and help. And I, what do you mean, what we should do? Uh-oh. Uh <laughs> help me! I'm guessing that's the professor. Hello, you, over there. Please help me. In my bag, there are some Pokeballs. Yeah, okay. I know who we're going to pick already, but I'll show you the different options. So we've got Trico, Torchic, and Mudkip. I'm actually going to go for Trico. Because in my Omega Ruby game, I had uh, Mudkip. So, before I go for this one. Right, hopefully we can do this nice and easy. Absorb, Lear, and Pound. Let's go for Pound on this one first. Okay, that was pretty good. Okay, that was also good. Let's try and absorb. What does the... Ah! Absorb! It's just like Leet's uh, seed that uh, Bulbasaur has. Oh, he's in Tekko again. Let's go for... Let's go for a couple more absorbs actually, because at the same time it's taking down its health, we gain health at the same time also. Oh. Whoa, that was actually a pretty powerful tackle. Let's use absorb one more time and then it should be down. And with this series I will be cutting out like, you know, what uh, you might call pointless battles, um, I might show one or two trainer battles at the beginning, um, and you know, sort of time lapse others. But anyway, phew! I went into the tall grass to survey wild Pokemon when I was suddenly jumped. You saved my hide, thanks a lot. Oh, but you're Norman's boy, Rocky. I didn't even realize who you were at first. You've grown into quite a young man. What? So this guy's known us for a long time, I'm guessing. Uh, this isn't the place for a chat, though. Come along to my lab. Ooh, this is so exciting getting the um, journey started off. I just love these cutscenes, but I'm sort of talking a bit over them in case of um, copyright or... Um, ID issues because I know Nintendo's been doing a bit of that again to Nintendo related videos but anyway so Rocky I heard so much about you from your father I'm guessing the guy who runs Pelberg gym called Norman is our dad I really have to remember stuff because I did play the original Ruby in Emerald game but never the original Sapphire but anyway <coughs> But he said that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. If that's true, it was quite a performance back there. Looks like you really are your father's son. Oh yes. To say thanks for rescuing me out of there, how about I give you that Pokemon you used earlier? Rocky received Trico! While you're at it, why don't you give a nickname to that Trico? Yep, that's the spirit. So, what do you want? What name, nickname would you like to go with? Uh, what should we call male Trico as a nickname? We could call him Leafy. No, Tree Boy, Tree Lizard. I can't think of a good enough nickname at the moment, so we'll just go for his original name, and then later on, once I find a guy who enables you to give your Pokemon nicknames, I will change the name. So, I'm 
I know I'm probably playing this wrong, but never mind. You know, if you work with your Pokemon and gain experience, I think you make a pretty excellent trainer. My girl May happens to be out on Route 103 right now, surveying, surveying Pokemon for me. It might not be a bad idea for you to head out there that way yourself. What do you think? Yes. Great. I'm sure May be happy to hear that too. She can help teach you what it means to be a trainer. Oh yes. And if you're ever lost along the way, use the area nav on your poker nav plus. Oh, that's the thing on the bottom screen. Uh, you can also so use it to see how to get to Route 103 where May is out ought to be. And if you or your Pokemon get tired, get some rest back at your new house. Okay, I just realised we've been recording for about 12 minutes, so we're going to go meet May, do that part of the story, and then I'll end off the episode. I love this game. Oh, now as this is our first Pokemon battle, I will obviously show it. Well, we did do another Pokemon battle back there, but I'm counting this one as technically our first one. So, use a pound on it. It's going to use Stream Shot, which I uh, what does that move do again? Uh, Ah uh, yeah, speed. I really need to read up on some of the moves and what things they do, even if they don't do any damage, like string short sure, obviously decreases your speed and stuff like that. So we'll go for another I was gonna say we're gonna go for another pound, but it got string shot in there before us, but that's because it's lowered our speed so much. Uh, for some odd reason it's string shot didn't work and it said something about Trico but now it is down and we have grown to level 6 yay so let's just run through grass past this guy and get to May oh. <laughs> I was not trying to do that Uh, we're just going to run from this battle, like I said. Um, I don't like to make my videos too long. And... Like I said, don't like to make the videos too long or too boring or anything like that. So, um, I try to... In about 12 minutes with these Pokemon videos. But, uh... It seems we'll be aiming for about 15 to 18 minutes in future. Okay. <clears throat> hey there, I work for Pokemart. For what I can see, you're a novice trainer. Am I right? Okay. Hang on. From what I can... You're a novice... I'm not a novice trainer. I've played Pokemon in Pokemon Yellow. Well, literally, that's quite old game. But anyway, being super kind-hearted as I am, I'm going to give you useful advice. Okay, this is just the generic stuff that most people who've played Pokemon should know by now, but of course, there's always new people coming to play Pokemon, so... Okay, first of all, that's a Pokemon there. Just look f out for the blue roof. We sell various of goodies, including Pokeballs for catching Pokemon. I'd like you to have these as part of a special promotion. Rocky obtained potion. Put in the medical pocket. Potions can be used anytime, so they can be very useful to hand. That is actually true. 
and this is a Pokemon Center, look for a red roof. Ask a woman inside and she restores your Pokemon health. Pokemon's health. Uh, ask a woman inside. Rather, ask the clone inside. And people should know what I mean by clone because in every Pokemon Center there's an illustration supposedly from the anime. They're all like either cousins like their cousins but also twins and triplets and that it's really weird and when i say clones that's what i mean by clones but also they look exactly like officer jenny from the pokemon anime just a little bit of trivia there for you uh that's it that was the advice from me for what does that say Su i'm just gonna say super kind-hearted clerk have a great journey! Oh, we will. But no, in every Pokemon game, we're gonna run into trouble. So, hmm. Should I... I'm actually gonna stop the episode here, actually, for today. And I'm gonna come up with a proper schedule, so people will be able to know when the Pokemon episodes will come out. But anyway, thank you everybody for watching so much. Episode 2 of Pokemon Alpha Sapphire playthrough. And my first episode of Pokemon Alpha Sapphire with the capture card. Because last time I didn't have the capture card while filming episode 1. But I filmed episode 1 before I got the capture card. Because I wanted to get the Training Beldum event and what have you. But uh, that is all from me. So let us press the save button. And I will try and get my outro right. So thank you everybody for watching once more. Remember to leave a like, favourite, share, comment. And also remember to subscribe if I haven't already said that. Remember to follow me on Twitter in the link in the description down below. Where I'll be posting multiple updates and stuff. And... That's really it, so until next time, stay golden, stay frosty, and bye Zs.